Hey, what's up coach? Welcome back to our YouTube channel. And our last video last week, we talked about the five stages of being a successful coach. And that was stage one. We talked about the idea. So if you missed that video, make sure go back to our YouTube channel and watch that. Otherwise this video here is not really, it's not going to make that much sense. So I want to make sure you watch that. Now, like I said, the last video we talked about the idea and taking action. Today, it's about getting started. And when I say getting started, I mean getting started the right way. Personally for me, when I got started with my business, I didn't know what the heck I was doing. I didn't have payment systems. I didn't have a sales system. I didn't have anything in place that legally protected me if a kid got hurt. I didn't know what I was doing. All I knew was, you know what? I want to train kids. I want to see if I can do this part time. That was my mindset. And that worked, but I ran into a lot of problems. And these are problems that I want you to avoid. And this is why when we think about getting started, we need to do this the right way. And in the last video I talked about, I'm going to give you uh, my ebook and video series for free. And I'll show you like legally how to get started and all that. But what we want to think about here is when we get started, we want to be a pro. And what I mean by this is you don't want to run your business like an amateur starting off. This is a big problem I see a lot of coaches face is they just think, well, I'm just going to train kids on the side. I'm going to get paid cash and checks. I'm not going to have a detailed schedule. I'm not going to have detailed plans when I train these kids. I'm just going to do this for fun. And I'm all for starting off and doing it for fun, but we want to run it like a pro. Because if you start off running your business like a pro, that means every angle is covered. That means you're very organized. That means your business is run like a true business. You're not just, you know, patching things together and hoping things are going to work out. And this is a, just a mindset. I, I look at it as it's one of those things that, you know, in your head, I'm going to run this like a real, like a real business. And if I don't, then I'm going to run into problems. And when we run it like a pro, you run into less problems. And what happens is parents and the kids that you train, they're going to respect you more because their first impression of you is going to be when they talk to you over the phone or when they meet you in person. And when you are a professional, when you get started, then it's a lot easier to gain clients faster. If you're sloppy and disorganized, and you're late, you're lazy, you're not accountable to the kids that you're training, why would they want to you know, continue training with you when you're getting started? And this is so key at the beginning. And like I said in the last video last week, if you want my full guide on getting started, getting clients, and I talk a lot about being professional, go to iTunes. It's very simple. Go to iTunes, find my podcast. It's just type in Ben Neighbors the same name that you see here on YouTube and leave me a review. When you leave me a review there, send me a screenshot of that review on Instagram or, or send it to me via email. You'll see my email address below this video. Once you do that, I will hook you up with that video series and ebook and that's going to be a game changer for you. And it's going to take you about an hour to go through, but that's something that I know is going to be extremely valuable for you if you're just getting started. So that's it for this video. I'll see you next week on week three. Thank <laughs> you.